Morning, y'all. Morning, y'all. Now, well, let's try. I'm gonna look like shit either way. Good morning, y'all. I am packing up. I just took a couple of days and one more my towel. There's my towel. This is the secret to traveling with my computer. This goes around my computer while I'm driving. My computer is in this cabinet right here. It's a tower, so if I don't pack stuff in around it, it wobbles a bit in this the shelf. See, I need I use the towel because then I can remove the towel when I get to where I'm going. And it lets the computer breathe a little. It does of course need ventilation while it's running. Ah! Well, I forgot something. I need to file my paperwork from my previous load. So that's what takes up the rest of the room in that drawer. Paperwork binder. Got laundry done. Got my, uh... Actually, I haven't done any shopping while I've been here. I mean, I've done some digital shopping, but that's all waiting for me back in Virginia. This load was a December load. My next load's a January load because today is the day after New Year's. I took New Year's Eve and New Year's Day off. Something I've always tried to do. I had to work last year while I was at Best Buy because those are pretty big days for uh, those are pretty big days for an electronics retailer right after Christmas. What's that noise? what that noise was. But, uh, we got our next load. I'm currently in Rapid City, South Dakota, and now we are on our way to Lexington, which is uh, a familiar place for us. And we've never come at it from this angle, so this will be new. New for us. I'll plug my beep 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 uh, thing in. Well, I think I'm ready to go. Efficiently packed up. I've got to throw away some uh, some garbage that has accumulated in the truck while I've been because I've been sleeping in the truck still while I've been off work because my sister does not have room for me at her place. Uh, I mean, she could probably make room, but I've got a bed right here, so why not use it? You know, hmm. that's the best part of this job. Is you can take time off pretty much anywhere. Though, uh, as I discovered, Rapid City a little bit difficult to get to and get out of hauling prime cargo, sadly. I had to deadhead 300 miles to get here, and now we're deadheading 400 miles to get out, so. Corporate has asked me not to take too many, <laughs> too many times off here, which I think we'll be able to manage. All right, let's do some driving.
got some food and spent uh, about an hour here. It's hard for me to take a break that's less than an hour just because I'm the kind of person who I really take a, a good, it takes me a good 15 minutes to unwind from driving to like relaxed. So it makes it a little difficult for me to take short breaks except when I'm just like stopping to use the bathroom actual like enforced relaxation is a little bit more difficult for me. No one coming from the right, sweet. And we gotta get back on 385. That'll take us down to US. Turn left south. onto US 385 South. Thank you. We aren't actually on Nebraska, too. This is a familiar highway to us. Continue for 116 miles. Admittedly not this part of it, but you know. All right, if you wanna be a big help to me, turn left now. Damn, all right. Uh, no big deal, no big deal, we'll just go in behind him. No one's coming from the left, no one's coming from the right. I am going. We are back on the road. Success, all right, cool. Not my best shift, but I don't care. We are rolling again, we are getting out of Alliance, Nebraska. I feel like I've heard of this town before, and I don't know why. Oh well. But uh, so I went into. I hear noises. <laughs> I went into the. Uh... Huh. I went into the uh, the truck stop where we were parked, and the only hot food they had was not now, Maxwell. The only hot food they had were uh, hot roller grill hot dogs and um, cups of soup. I don't even know what kind of soup, I did not look. <laughs> because they were sitting out on the counter and they were, uh, I assume they were pretty old. But um, <laughs> roller grill hot dogs and roller grills too, let's just call it that. So uh, I went across the street to that Maverick that we that we drove through while I was coming into the, uh, into the truck stop there. And uh, found out that hey, it's okay if you park there. If you're coming inside to grab food, they don't mind. <laughs> they just don't do overnight parking, is all. Um, and uh, B, every single Maverick has wonderful hot foods, apparently. So that was nice. We got to uh, I got to eat actual hot food, popcorn chicken to be to be precise. And uh, there you get enough popcorn chicken in one of those little boxy things from uh, from a Maverick that it can actually go through an entire package of McDonald's hot mustard. So I was pretty happy about that. All right, so we're about 80 miles from Lexington, Nebraska. I'm getting my paperwork for this load started before I forget again. I mean, technically, paperwork with this load started when I fueled up before we left. Got a receipt already, but I've got to do my trip sheets. Which is, uh, we have to keep the paperwork we file. I file all my paperwork digitally, so they never leave the truck. As you saw earlier today, I keep them in a file folder in the cabinet up there. And transmit them digitally to Prime and by extension Palmer. I'm required to keep all of my paperwork for at least two months. I keep them a little bit longer than that. I need... This is the cover sheet that we use so that it goes to the right... the right people at Prime. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I guess I should get moving. Let's get to Lexington. See if we can't drop off this trailer. Your destination is on the left. But it's possible. Turns out, 
my MG. I've got my loaded trailer. And we just have to weigh the thing. And luckily they provide precisely the scale for us to use. parking spot at the Walmart right around the corner and uh, that's my day done so I'm actually gonna try and get this thing happening daily again well for the first time really but uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can't get daily uploads to be a thing uh, probably on a seven day delay that way I have time to get the videos done find somewhere to upload them upload them and get a, get a week ahead of it at a time uh, probably means that there will be some stuff that just never comes out from the, the gap between where I am and where I'm, or between where I was in December and now. Not that there was a whole lot there. There was some cool stuff, but I'll grab what I can, trust me. Um, anyway, um, so yeah, that's my day done. We're in Lexington, Nebraska. Just picked up the load. It's super light. Uh, Y'all saw the scale weights. That's perfectly normal, apparently, for this load. So we've got some cool stuff we get to go through tomorrow. Uh, we're going to be pretty much non-interstate almost the entire time. Uh, we'll be taking ooh, Nebraska 10. We gotta go east to Kearney on 80 and then take Nebraska 10 south into Kansas and then we should meet up with uh, we'll be on US 36 very briefly and then um, we'll be on US 24 for a little while. Uh, we're gonna pass a pretty cool tourist trap that I'm gonna try and get some footage of if I can. Wish me luck there. And then um, we'll jump on US 81 South for most of the rest of the day, which will briefly become an interstate. Uh, I think it becomes 135? 133? 135. It's, it joins 35. Yeah, 135. Um, so it'll be an interstate for a little while, so that'll be fun. Uh, this is all new stuff. This is all new territory. I've never left 80 in this part of Nebraska before, so... Uh, we had lots of new stuff today, lots of new stuff tomorrow, so stay tuned. You can find me here on YouTube. Um, check out the comments. Leave comments. I check them all the time. They ping to my phone, so I see them a lot. Um, you can also drop it on Twitter. I'm there all the time. All the time. I check it basically every time I stop. And like three times a day when I'm not in the... Or okay, more than three times a day. Like three times an hour uh, when I'm not driving. Um, so yeah, you can find me on Twitter, AzurAngel17. I'm also that same name on Twitch, Twitter, or yeah, Twitch, Twitter, Xbox Live, Steam, pretty much anywhere I can have that username, I'm there. Less so of the gaming services, because truck driver. Um, so yeah, drop in, say hi. I'll be around, and uh, give me a sub if you like the videos, because that's always cool. And YouTube keeps telling me I need to actually tell people that. I don't know, like 75% of my views come from non-subs, so. Granted, I'm still using default pictures for the uh, header images at the top of the page as well, and I don't have a channel trailer. I'm not actually very good at this whole YouTube thing, but, you know, whatever. Anyway, that's my day done. I should stop rambling. I'll get better at these outro things the more I do, I hope. So, yeah.